And Joel, we're here at Westlake Middle School, a staging area of sorts. As that search continues, I want to take a step out of the shot so we can show you the totality of the agencies here. Cary Police Department, the Fairview Fire Department, which is just a couple of miles down the street. We have Wake County EMS, Holly Springs Fire just uh, arriving on the scene as well. And then Wake County has their mobile unit here to try and coordinate everything going on. Still very active, still very fresh. We do want to share with you the information we have at this point. Now, this is all coming from RDU, a twin engine turboprop aircraft reported landing gear issues as they approached the airport. The aircraft landing on runway 5R23L before veering into the guests. Now, first responders confirming one person on board was taken to Duke Hospital with minor injuries. They are still searching for that second person. Reports are that person jumped out of the plane without a parachute, possibly trying to hit a body of water near Westlake Middle School. In terms of operations at the airport, that uh, runway continues to be closed until further notice. Uh, at least one American Airlines flight from Dallas diverted. Others have had delayed landings. Now, we do know that plane took off from Rayford. We did not know anything about the individuals involved except uh, the person who was at RDU. Again, taken with minor injuries. A search continues for that second individual. Please tell us they are anticipating releasing more information uh, at 430. So we are going to stay here on scene, connect with them, see what we can find out, pass that on to you as soon as as possible. Joel and Lauren.